So hey guys, welcome to another video. Um, I'm Black Phoenix. I'm a streamer on Twitch and a YouTube cre uh, content creator playing Identity 5 mostly. And this is my lovely wife. Hello. Do you like to introduce nice yourself? Nice to meet you, yes. <laughs> my name is Kira, I'm his wife. Yeah. We all know, and uh, I'm also like blogger vlogger, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, because I, I make YouTube videos and my husband helps, helps. me quite a lot. And today we're going to try, I'm going to try for the first time to play the game. Do you know what it's called? It's not going to help you, it's not going <laughs> to... Whatever, yeah, we're going to play. <laughs> so, we're playing Identity 5. Um, also called Identity V, depending on... Okay. Uh, I don't know. Um, so, I, you've heard me talk about this game a couple of times. What do you think you know? A couple of times? A couple, a couple. <laughs> but she doesn't know the name, yeah? Well, I forget it. You also yeah. like to play Paladins. I like Paladins. Yeah. Because it's nice. Why do you like Paladins? Because it has nice graphics. It has nice and graphics. it's very colorful. You like the colors. And I like characters and costumes there. So and guns as well. You like the guns. <laughs> <laughs> so this game is a little bit darker in its coloring screen because mostly it's because it's a mobile game yeah. first. So what do you know about this game? Well, I know there are hunters and there are... Um, people who are being hunted by these hunters. Yeah, survivors. Survivors, yes. And the, there are different type of hunters and some of them are difficult to play with, some of them are okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, survivors... And someone's called Ultimate Nipple. Ultimate Nipple? Yeah, I just saw wow. that pop up on chat. Okay. Wow. Shout out to Ultimate Nipple if you ever watch this video. <laughs> yeah. And survivors, they need to kind of lock the doors, is, I guess. Unlock, go, unlock the doors. Unlock yeah. the doors yeah. and um, to escape uh, from um, the hunters. Yes. And also survivors, they can uh, escape from the chair sometimes. So they, they help each other and there is a healer as well, I guess. There's a what? Healer. Oh, the they're, they're, yeah, you, everyone, everyone can heal everyone. Oh, okay. Ah, you can also like see the lights where you can see the survivors. Do you know, and you yeah. see when the hunter is getting closer to you? Yes. Do you know how? The hunt is red. Yes. Um, sometimes you can see, if you've sometimes with some abilities, you can see the hunter through walls, yes, but not usually. Okay. Um, you know the hunter's near you when you um, have a heartbeat. Mm. You'll be okay. able to hear it and you'll be able to see like, you'll see, you'll see like a purple glow coming from yeah. their chest. Uh, and you'll be able to hear it. The, the faster the heartbeat, the closer the hunter. Oh. Okay, so there are different things around the map. They're called ciphers, they're little machines. Mm -hmm. And these machines, um, what you do is you go up to them and you just spend your time on them, yes? Mm -hmm. And the percentage of that machine will go up. Once it gets to 100, it's completed. And you, uh, the team, the survivors need to um, finish five of these machines, okay? okay? Uh, once those five are finished, then the exit doors can be opened, yeah? So the hunter's job is to make sure that the survivors die before they get out, yes? Okay. <laughs> the hunter wins if he gets two or more people out, um, sorry, out, two okay. or more people dead. Well, uh, I'm going to suck in the game, so that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> the survivors uh, win if they get more than two people out. It's a tie if they get two. Okay, let's smash the survivors. So, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to start off with... Uh, she has never played this before. We are, no. We're not doing the tutorial. We're going to do it on my account because I can't be bothered to make a new account just for the sake of this. We're going to play against some bots. Uh, she'll play survivor first. She did want to play hunter, so I think... The best way to understand how what a hunter needs to be doing is to be able to see what survivors are meant to be doing. Okay. You can play any of these characters right now because that's all I've got. I like Enchantress. Enchantress. You like Enchantress? Yeah, okay, so nice. um, there are different characters and different things that they can do. Enchantress, she is meant to dodge and uh, run away from hunters and annoy them as much as possible. She has this monkey head and she can use it to kind of stun the hunter quickly. W-A-S-A-D, if you're playing... Um, PC? Yeah. Duck. You need to be able to use three fingers. Yeah. This one will be your W, ah, this one will be your D. Je... S is what? your back. What? Yeah. So look around is this. Bigger. Oh, we got a hunter on this already. That's fine. That's yeah. your look around. I told you. Okay, it's fine. Oh, run okay, away. run away. <laughs> okay. Uh, you can look by doing this to see where you're going. 
Oh, oh. You've been hit once. So if you get hit twice, you get knocked down. You need to hold on to the mouse to see where you're going here. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. whatever. You kind of want to... You're not much of a PC player and uh, you've never played I'm not played much PC. of a player in general. The hunt is following us, yes? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we can actually stun him quickly if you want to. How to do? Press number one, but you're about to be hit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. So you, you need to be able to do that at the same time as moving, yes? Bringing you down to basement. Oh wow, that's the worst luck to start the match. Basement is probably the hardest place to get out of. <laughs> oh, what does it mean? That the, the I'm dying? Oh, or? you're about to die, yeah. Oh. Nobody came to save you, you're dead. <laughs> beep. Beep, <laughs> well, that's beep, a good beep, way beep, to start beep, off beep, the beep, match. Beep. That's, that's a good way to start off the game. Nobody saved me. <laughs> Before we continue, please tell them why you're having so much difficulty with this. It's because you're not much of a gamer. What games have you played, Kira? I played Harry Potter. I play, played... Which Harry Potter, like? The first one. Philosopher's Stone from, like, when was that game from? Where, oh. where you needed to collect um, beans and you're like, oh, Panda, open the door. Yeah, we have to draw with the magic, yeah. I played this, you know, game with uh, chicken, let's say. Like, do you remember the cartoon with the chicken? With the chicken. It also had the friend that... Chicken Little? Yeah, Chicken Little. Yeah, okay, I don't... I think I played that game, actually. It's, yeah. well, it was a cool game. Yeah. And, and you played Sonic? Sonic I played, and also I played Shrek. Shrek. When was the last time you actually played, seriously? Games? Yeah. I don't have time for that. When was the last time you did it? Years ago. Like, how many years ago? Like, what, five, six years ago I played... So she doesn't even know how to use WSAD keys or that's mouse control, fine. and that's completely fine, that's completely fine. Okay, so when you get up to it, it will tell you what button you need to press. <laughs> this <laughs> is incredibly so difficult. <laughs> Q. Q. Q, start doing it. Yeah. Okay, so it will start decoding, and then you'll see a little dial come up, and you'll need to press the space bar when you get to the curve. You'll see like a grid, this in space. Which one of those? Oh, you missed it. I, 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 no, no. Yeah, keep on going. That's a pallet you can drop if you press space, but it's fine. Okay, Hunter's after you right now. So cool. Keep on running. They keep on finding you. I just don't want to die. It's okay. You see that guard thing that comes up, the little progress bar? Still... Look, find the Hunter. Where is the Hunter? Oh, he's there. Okay. He's ignoring you. That's a nice thing. So now, ta-da, you did it. And it will continue. If you miss it, it will alert the Hunter because you accidentally shocked yourself. Again, ready? Nice. Okay, you finished one. Okay. That's good. And you need to go and find another one. So she's already started doing it. My wife is Russian, for people who didn't know, so she will swear probably I tried Russian. to do it quietly. She tried to do it quietly. <laughs> <laughs> Even I miss them sometimes, it's fine. At the beginning of the game, you start this, you miss them a lot. <laughs> Yours? The hunter's like, what's going on over there? <laughs> She's, she's missed it like three times. I'm so sorry. It's fine. No, it's completely normal to do this. Luckily, the hunter hasn't hit any bars. She's just missed one. And she just gave up. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. I think it's because you just finished one. Okay, so okay. you've got three more left, or your team has three more left. Well, someone's working. Can you see it wiggling? Oh, they finished it. Okay, so now two exit gates have appeared. The hunter now, the bots usually go from one, and if they find someone, they will stay there, but if they don't find someone, they go to the other one. That's what, what bots Q, do. yes? Yep. This one doesn't have any calibration, so you can, you just have to stand at it. Okay, so you, you've escaped. So that's all. So yeah, that's, that was all. Well done. Cool. You're recording. Okay, so these are the survivors, by the way, just for, so you're interested. I know you're not going to play Survivor now, but which survivors look interesting to you? There is a second page as well. Well, I like the Enchantress. Mm -hmm. Priestess looks quite cool. Uh, Gardener looks quite cool as well. Mm -hmm. Gardener's like one of the kind of symbols of the game, pretty much. Cause and female dan dan dancer. Dancer, she looks, she has a Russian kokoshnik or something. She might be Russian. She's called Margareta Zell. I don't know where she's from. Don't it, it reminds me of you as well. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. People say I have his voice, but I don't. This is first officer. I think he's Spanish. His name is... <sighs> Yeah. I sense. I'm not <laughs> Spanish. <laughs> well, you live. You've lived in Spain for how long? Ten, ten years. years. So, so that's yeah. Fine. So hunters. I think there's only there is only one. Oh, I like this one. It's quite cool. You like this one? Yeah. Oh, you like Lucino? Weird. Okay. He yeah, is he looks weird. Reptilian. Okay. And I like Wu Chang. Wu Chang. Okay. Wu Chang. He's very very popular. So which one would you like to try? 
Uh, let's do Wu Chang. Okay. Um, so Wu Chang's ability is that he has an umbrella. Okay. He has two forms. He has his white form and his black form. Mm -hmm. His white one is very good at chasing. So mm -hmm. he's a little bit faster and he has a better attack okay. distance. Yeah. Um, his black form is better at attacking because he can attack faster. Yeah, it does. He's a little bit difficult, but he's like... It's fine. Just let's go for it. Okay, what do I do now? So you want to, so you can see the ciphers too, but you need to go and find hunters. So they obviously want to be on ciphers as you just, as you know, yes? Uh-huh. Um, so no one's on this one, so you might want to go to the next one. You he's, can actually... He, I like it, the way he's walking, I just know. like nicely. Like a boss. <laughs> yeah. You can use your listen ability if you stand still a second and, and press three. And look around. Just look around the other direction, you're looking to the wall. Look around faster that way, yeah. Can you see anyone? Ah, you can see someone over there, you see? Okay. Press three to stop it. Yeah, okay. So you can see, actually see there are two people on those ciphers. You can teleport to those ciphers if you want. Give it a second. Okay, hold T. Uh, and now kind of use your mouse to push it back that direction and then click. And then you press one. Ooh, now your black form. Okay, let's see where you are. There's a survivor, there you see. So you can attack them by clicking. Oh, you missed. Okay, she's gonna try and close this on you. Oh, you can't hit them through that. You can break it by Q if you want to, or you can just go find her. Whoop, 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 whoop. Go oh, close, go around. Oh, so yeah. cute. Nice. Nice. See that? You did, you did a charge attack there, yeah? No. It makes it so you'll have a little bit more distance. Is that the same one? No, I think that's another one. Oh, my lips. It's fine. So you've already hit one. Catch it. Ooh. Oh. oh, she closed it. She's even waiting for you. She'll close it. You can press Q to break it. Mm -hmm. She's over there. Yeah. You'd probably be able to hit her if you were white. White has a much bigger hitbox. Mm -hmm. They've got one cipher already, <laughs> so they've nearly finished. Oh, and whack! Whoop! She, you hit the wall. Nice hit. Mhm. Mm you now have unlocked your second ability. If you press number two, when you're looking at that her direction, you'll be able to like stun her for a second. Please. Space bar to go. Okay, it's fine. Oh, so close. Nice. Okay, now if you go up to her and press E, you need to go up to her and press E. Mm -hmm. There you go. And you need to find a chair. They'll be red. Look around behind you. There's one behind you. Uh, to your right, I think there is one. Okay, there's one. You yeah. See? Look, you need to go around the building. It's behind the wall. Yeah, and I think behind you. Yeah, there you go. And press Q. Okay, you've got one. They can still come and save, and you can. I we can. Someone's actually near because I can see that they're near. Someone's on the box. On the box, I think. If you press, if you look at that direction, oh, they popped the last one. So, oh, they're behind. They're trying to save. But you didn't need to stuck in a tree. They saved, but it's fine. It's been knocked down once. Okay, you can see someone. So they're running to that exit gate right now. You actually have one hit. You see red coming out of your eyes. Yeah. That means you've got a one hit knocker down. So oh. I would go just to your left. Yeah. Hold it. Oh, close. Ooh. There you go. Okay. And I think she's a different doctor than the one you took a minute. Or a different one you took. Okay, there's a chair just there. Okay, one person's already escaped. Mm -hmm. Q, yeah? Yeah. They might come and save. I don't know if they will save. You might want to check the closest exit. Oh, there's someone to your right. You see? Come on. I'll help you by pressing it. One second. And she comes near. I'm going to help. Okay, I'll take it down. Whoa. 
Какая противная. She's not here. I also knocked her down there, so I need to help you. This doctor's very naughty, yeah? Yeah, I can't get her. Uh, you could teleport. I could help you, but I don't want to help you too much. It's okay. <laughs> I can help you with the abilities. Wait! Shh. Shh. No, she got out the dungeon. If she's the last one alive, she can get out of the thing. That's everyone escaped. So, okay. Like so it. guys, if you speak Russian and you would like to learn English, you can follow me on YouTube and watch my videos, how to improve your English. Whatever. Okay, and if you want to see more videos like this, then I would like to um, leave as many likes as possible and we might be able to convince Kira again to come and join us. I've been thinking about some other ideas that we could do with Kira as well to do with Identity 5, um, a little bit different than this. If you would like to see more of her playing this, please like and please comment something down below. Um, and subscribe if you want to see more Identity 5 content. I stream every Monday, Thursday, Saturday um, mm -hmm. on Twitch. Yeah. Uh, I usually play Identity 5 and a couple of other games, but I usually play Identity 5 every day, every, every stream. So please come and hang out on Twitch, and I hope to see you guys soon. Okay. Anything else you want to say? No. <laughs> okay, bye-bye.